The Lazy Girl's Guide to Concealer. Hey everyone, OK, so today I'm going to be sharing with you truly one of the best kept secrets in the universe. I feel like another makeup artist has said that. So, concealer. Now, I'm wearing glasses, I'll take them off. I'm wearing glasses because my eyes are very, very sore. And I've got this hideous, like, creature living inside it. Who can say why? Probably scratched it. Right, concealer. What happens is, is because of Instagram and YouTube and, and so many, you know, prolific makeup artists, we're all concealing and doing all this wonderful stuff and it's great and I do it, it's fabulous. But once upon a time, in a far off land, there lived a technique called concealing dark areas. And we totally forgot that because now we like painting our faces with it and I'm all for that, as you well know. But this is the Lazy Girl's Guide to Concealer, which is concealing the areas under our eyes that are actually dark. Very, very strange. So what we're gonna do is, this is where I am most darkest. Is that even good English? Of course, there is a thousand watt bulb blaring at me, so almost nothing is dark on my face. Beautiful. But this is where I'm most dark. I really don't need it all the way down to my lip, and I doubt you do too, but there's nothing wrong with that. Let's please everybody. This is the areas I'm darkest. Little finger, ring finger, press and pat and push into your skin. I'm using Jane Iredell in Lighten in shade one. And this just conceals the areas that are dark, making your face look better, making it look more awake, more open, without screaming, concealer, contour, highlight, and all of that stuff. You know, this is how people used to conceal dark circles, just underneath their eyes. It's quite shocking. Probably incredibly liberating. Now, I don't know if you can see, but I can see in the mirror. It looks brighter. It looks more without that scary creature living in it. And that is the Lazy Girl's Guide to Concealer. It's revolutionary. It's controversial. Just like everything I do, really. You have no idea. You really don't. It's been a hell of a week. But I'm still here, still going on. Don't forget to rate, thumbs up, subscribe because it equals love to me and love equals a kiss and a hug and preferably something remotely sensual. And I won't lie, it's been a bit of a long time. And I will see you all soon, bye bye.